Hey guys, and um, we all know Black Ops 2 is coming out very soon, and um, I'm excited, um, along with most people. Um, I know at the Free Studio and in Australia, I think it is, Black Ops 2 has already come out, so some of you watching this video might have already played it, um, so that's good for you. But I'm just going to tell you my views on Black Ops 2 and what I really think about it. And so, firstly, I think calling it Black Ops 2 makes it sound cheap. Like they could, like, surely they could have thought something out else because, like, they had a Modern Warfare. Then I suppose that kind of was catchy. And then they brought out Black Ops, and it was like, I don't know, it just sounds cool. And then when they have Black Ops 2, it sounds childish. Like, I could, like, surely they can think of something else. Because the thing with Modern Warfare, MW3, MW2, it goes, but Black Ops 2, it's. You know, you can't call it BO2, it sounds like Body Order Number 2. So, you know what I mean? Like, I think the name of Black Ops 2 is a bit childish. Here I have two best sellers of COD. Um, well, all of the COD games are pretty much best sellers. And there's MW3 and Black Ops. And these games are going to be forgotten about. Not totally, there's obviously going to be those few people that still play it. But, I mean, for instance, on MW3, I'm she's 13. I want to get to Prestige 12, and I'm sure a lot of other people want to get to, I mean, well, I want to get to Prestige 20. I'm sure a lot of people want to get to a high prestige as well, but they can't, because when Black Ops 2 comes out, this game is going to be forgotten about. And there's nothing really memorable on this. Like, Black Ops, like, for instance, Black Ops had zombies. People still play that now. When MW3 came out, people still play this. I mean, what has this got? Like, zombies. Chaos mode, that's about it. I mean... Not many people even play Chaos Mode, and if they do, not many people are still going to play it. But Black Ops, that had zombies, and people still play it now. But because Black Ops 2 is said to have zombies as well, then I really think this is going to be forgotten about then as well. So these games are pretty much pointless now. And I know that games do eventually, like, get forgotten, like, get forgetted about. But, I mean, still, I, I, I don't understand, really. Like, why bring out... A new game. I mean, it's only been a year as well. Why bring out a new game after one great game has really come out? I mean, at least let people have a go at doing this. And like, I would say about a year and a half, maybe about nearly about two years. Because some games, they like make one game and then it takes ages for the next one to come out. Like movies, for instance, Transformers One that came out in two thousand seven. Transformers Two came out in two thousand ten. That's three years difference. I mean, I'm not saying that with games, but. I feel as though these great games are just going to be forgotten about, and therefore, Black Ops 2, you know, I don't know how to put it. And one more bad thing about Black Ops 2, and then I'm going to, like, say good parts. I've seen gameplays of this on the internet, and on YouTube, by LEI and stuff, and it looks too modern. It looks like Crisis. If you ever played Crisis 2, or Crisis 3 even, the graphics are so sharp. Like, I don't know, but I know Modern Warfare, like, I don't mean the game Modern Warfare, I mean, like, actual real-life wars, they are realistic, and the games are progressing to get more and more realistic. But I just feel as though that the game, it's too sharp and, like, it's more futuristic than modern or what or with the present day. So, I, I, don't, I honestly don't know. Basically, I'm just saying that it's the graphics are too sharp, but okay, good things now. It's a new COD. Um, there's going to be snipers in the game, obviously, so that's good. And it comes out a day after my birthday, which is annoying. This is more of a personal one, but it comes out a day after my birthday, which is annoying because I would want it on it. Because that's what happened with MW3. You could probably work out when I was, the day I was born and the month now. Um. Yeah, so there's not really many good points, but that's probably because I haven't played it yet. Oh, the kill streaks. The kill streaks look really useless. Like the UAV, it's just like lasts for five seconds, and then there's a drone as well. It's like pointless. So in the comments, tell me what you think of Black Ops 2, and whether you agree with what I said or you want to add anything. Just feel free to post in the comments. So bye.